Breaking news here on Sky News, and we've just heard that Nicola Sturgeon has now been released. Um, she was, of course, arrested earlier today by Police Scotland. Um, I've got the statement here in my hand. In fact, she was released just 20 minutes ago. So this has happened... Um, just uh, a few minutes ago. It says uh, the investigation into Scottish National Party funding and finances update. A 52-year-old woman, Nicola Sturgeon, was who was arrested earlier today, Sunday the 11th of June, as a suspect in connection with the ongoing investigation into the funding and financing of the Scottish National Party, has been released without charge. She has been released without charge pending further investigation. It goes on, a report will be sent to the Crown Office and Procurator Fiscal Service. The matter remains active for the purposes of the Contempt of Court Act 1981 and the public are therefore advised to exercise caution if discussing it on social media. A warning of course from the police there. So Nicola Sturgeon released. Let's get a crossover live now to Glasgow where our Scotland correspondent Connor Gillies is there. Um, so, Connor, she spent the day speaking to police today. Seven hours or so of questioning for the former First Minister of Scotland, Nicola Sturgeon, brought in uh, to face those questions just after 10 o'clock this morning. We understand she presented herself and was then arrested by those officers when she turned up at that police station, released without charge pending further inquiries within the last uh, couple of minutes. This is an investigation that has focused primarily on the funding and the finances of the SNP, the governing party here in Scotland. Uh, a discussion over the course of the last couple of years around £600,000 that was raised for the cause of a second Scottish independence referendum, a second vote that has not happened, and there have been questions around that cash. Today came the crescendo in this investigation. We've had two arrests leading up to this moment, but then, of course, that seven hours of detention for uh, Nicola Sturgeon. Of course, this follows hot on the heels of her, the arrest of her husband, the former chief executive of the SNP, Peter Murrow. He spent 12 hours in custody back in April of this year. Those pictures at the time showing those officers swarming the property that they share on the outskirts of Glasgow. Officers spent more than 30 hours inside that home gathering, collating, bagging evidence and have clearly spent the last number of months piecing together and plotting their next move that resulted in Nicola Sturgeon being arrested today. And this has been an investigation and this moment from police in the last few minutes has followed a pattern because each of the arrests and of the suspects in this long-running SNP probe each and every suspect has been released without charge pending further inquiries.